Top 3 Ghosts Trapped on Video Hello folks all over the world, here we are again my friends, some channels on the paranormal continue to disclose as probable, decidedly incredible videos, where even the author initially reports that the material disclosed is for entertainment purposes only, as the case of this footage where a witch landing on the windshield of a car and then getting closer and closer and attacking the author of the film. From the analysis of the product it is clear that it is a CGI although shadows and lights have been adapted really well to the 3D object. Thanks to the darkness of the night and the low video resolution, however, the result could be deceiving. And now let's move on to the more interesting material. Human Remains and Presences In Ottawa, the capital of Canada in the southeast of the province of Ontario, lives Mo, a very famous investigator of the paranormal who for several years has been publishing his explorations, on the YouTube channel entitled, Mo Sargi, where it is possible to see some of the most frightening patrols of abandoned places, around the web. Three months ago, in August 2022 Mo visited a really terrible abandoned hospital, with blood on the walls, dirty medical equipment and other creepy human remains, and it looks like something or, someone, was watching Mo. Let's see. Let me tell you guys, this is probably the greatest abandoned hospital that I have ever seen because everything is left behind. Like, I'm talking every little thing. These people just totally abandoned this place, left the hospital behind. The hospital is totally in the dark, and Mo walks through the various rooms showing the collapse of the office furniture, when he arrives in an area where, he perceives a lot of negativity, and he does not notice a frightening anomaly, described by users in the comments. It is a hospital, it's not a place that you want to be, it's not a positive place. Also check it out, we got another bed over here with a lot of stuff left behind on it. Oh my god. <laughs> I did not even realize that there was a mirror there and it terrified me for a sec. Have you seen it too? In the mirror on the right, appears for a moment the face of a gaunt, ghostly grey face of a figure in a white coat that looks like a doctor. Place is super cool. Really, really amazing. Oh. Um. Okay, is this the wind? I mean, I don't feel a draft with my hand. Hold on a sec. There's probably a, a wind or a draft in here. Yeah, there probably is. Okay, that kind of freaked me out for a sec. Mo finds some really creepy rooms in the surgery ward, and in the comments, someone suggests calling the police. Oh my god. We got blood everywhere. Holy shit. Jeez. Okay, this is, I don't want to be in this room, that's gross. Is that a body bag? Oh, no, that's not a body bag. I thought that was a body bag for a sec. Jesus Christ. No, that's just a mattress. It's so strange though. It's got like these pipes coming down from it. So as you guys can see, I do have my UV light over here and this is all blood. Holy shit, this is literally, there's blood everywhere in this room, man. Mo moves to the archives area, where he finds numerous plates and x-rays scattered in the furniture, when he hears strange disturbing noises, coming from the adjacent rooms. Secret rather than just be left out like this. What the hell was that? I thought I heard something. Mo turns the camera in the corridor, that does not show anything, he probably feels observed and turns the camera towards the tunnel for a second time, after all, for fractions of a second, a strange creepy figure in a white dressing gown, appears where there was nothing. I thought I heard something. Even when he moves to another surgery room, Mo involuntarily films what appears to be, a humanoid figure watching him, from one of the rooms down the hall, pay attention. I just, it, it amazes me how this place just keeps going and going. By all this? Probably not, actually. Look at this. Like, look at this. There's a, a bed here with... Oh my god. There's surgical rooms literally everywhere. According to many users and Mo himself, this is probably the most horrifying abandoned hospital ever, and certainly a place where a thorough paranormal investigation could yield astounding results. Entity Against Cats in 2020, a French woman named Lorraine, 
who lives alone with her two cats, opened a TikTok channel titled T.I. Kiwi 54 Official to post funny videos of her cat's daily life. After months of peace, in March 2022, strange things begin to happen inside her home. As the woman passes through the kitchen door, in total absence of wind, the door slams against her shoulder, injuring her. Also in the following days his cats behaved in an unusual way, constantly annoyed by something invisible. Afraid of the situation, Loren asks her community for help and purchases motion sensor cameras that she places around her home. During her absence, the cameras record orbs, strange noises, show the crazy attitude of her cats, and doors opening and closing by themselves. Exasperated by these continuous strange events, Loren decides to follow another advice from her followers by buying a spirit box. From the sessions emerges a very sad story of a man named Alexander, who committed suicide in that house after losing his wife. Despite Loren's attempts to help Alexander, the paranormal phenomena do not cease. One afternoon, 40 minutes after Loren left the house, the spirit box lit up by itself with Alexander's voice speaking. For days Loren starts to hear noises in the kitchen during the night, so she moves one of the cameras, managing to capture a dark shadow and the sound of falling objects. This is one of the many footages Loren is posting on her channel about this story that is making her life a nightmare. You can find the link to her TikTok channel in description below this video. This is not a courtesy visit. There is a very particular street in California, USA, exactly in Placer County near Roseville, Dyer Lane which has a past of murders, satanic sects and spirits which, according to the locals, manifest themselves exactly in this place. A man named Tim lives alone in a house in this area and has conducted numerous paranormal investigations over the past years. In 2021, Tim opens a YouTube channel to film strange happenings inside his home. Initially thinking it was a trespassing by some thug, Tim immediately realizes that it is something that may have followed him into the house from the old paranormal patrols conducted in the area. Published on the YouTube channel, The Hooker, the videos show the escalation of the frightening strange phenomena that man has been undergoing for more than a year.
These manifestations also annoy Tim's pets, a dog and a cat, who seem frightened, and drawn from different directions in the house. Fuck, man. Fuck off, dog. You fucking see that, dude. Why every time I'm fucking alone, dude? Fuck. In the middle of summer in August, Tim is woken up by the bedroom door, that opens and closes continuously by itself, then he is attracted by a loud noise coming from outside the house, but when he returns to the room he finds a terrible and bitter surprise. <laughs> Fun. Fun. David. Some noise coming from there. Oh hell fucking no. Fuck. Dude. Upon his return to the house, Tim finds the mirror in his room's closet completely broken, a damage that starts to worry him so he installs a fixed camera towards the door, and captures something really scary. From the adjacent room, the camera captures what appears to be a dark shadow, similar to an old man, crossing the room from left to right. In the spectrographic analysis there are no signs that suggest modifications or tampering of the original film. If this video is confirmed, then Tim could be in danger, as we have seen on other occasions on the persecution of some famous investigators of the paranormal. The internet never ceases to amaze, and after showing you a witch in the, is it an hoax, we could not help but also show a group of young people struggling with a demon, which according to some popular channels, were attacked with serious damage. Our episode ends here, I thank you for watching, if you appreciated our work, leave a like to this video to help us, follow us on our social channels and on this channel, see you next episode my friends and good night.